Hey guys, um, just doing a little bit of exploring in Vung Viang. I hired a bike for the day, just out by myself, getting the drone up, just capturing a lot more of the place from the air, and stumbled upon this little place, sort of halfway between the city and Vung Viang and the turn off to Blue Lagoon 1, but Check out this landscape guys, a little bit of a farm there. There was only a small sign off the road to come down into and it was the cave that caught sign that caught me. I did not know there was a swimming hole here. But this is what I was confronted with. And I got down here. Crystal clear water. I'll just zoom in a bit for you guys. Have a go that. It just goes straight up. This water is coming out of that little cave over there. Just there. Comes out, gets a bit of fresh air. Then ducks back in under the rocks, under the mountain there. Big cast limestone mountains, giving it that nice bluey green tinge. And you can swim here. The water is clean, refreshing, and it is. I'm absolutely soaked. Went in in my pink undies. Check it out on the video, now and loud. Subscribe if you haven't. Big thumbs up. Um, back to widescreen. There we go, and the cave is just up here, very isolated, I passed four girls walking out when I was coming in, but nobody else in here other than that, and this cave was something I really want to come back to and explore some more, it's like an old um, lava tube, which is extraordinary for this type of mountain, but... Just going to show you the entrance because it does get dark in there. Bit of a little bridge, stick bridge. And then it just disappears off up into there. And I thought it opens up into like a can, uh, big area once you get in there. And then it just follows this tube and it just keeps going and going. And once. I got far enough that there was no natural light coming in. I've only got thongs on. It's time to turn back, Todd. So if you're by yourself, better off getting getting the old the old fella here who offered to give me a guide. Or make sure you've got more than one torch on you and somebody else with you. A beautiful spot. If you're coming to Laos, make sure you come to Vang Vieng and hire a bike, do some exploring, get away from those guided tour groups, we'll give you 10 minutes here, 15 minutes here, off to each stop, it's not the way to travel Vang Vieng, got to do this sort of shit, off the little side roads and explore, this was a great find, good find Todd.